Hello everyone, this is Fufal Yoshi, and we're back with more Dragon Quest VIII. In the last episode, we, uh, went to, uh, Neos, that's right, the town, the goddess statue or whatever, and, yeah, um, did I forget to do something in here? I don't think so. Anyway, town of the goddess statue, and, I forgot to, and we can do that later. And, yeah, town of Neos, that didn't work out so well. There wasn't a whole lot for us to do there, but we almost got a new uh, member of our monster team. And unfortunately, we played Hexilla, which I'm kind of sad about. But, uh, I guess we'll just have to wait and see if uh, we can put Hexilla back on the team at any point. Because I know Hexilla, um, he, uh, he grows really well, and devil's this? Did we never come here? Huh. Oh well. Let's actually move on with the plot like I've been saying for a while now. I mean, Jimmy Chris. Oh jeez, we went way too fast. Uh, okay. Turn around, turn around, turn around. So anyway, okay, so Macho Ma Marcello should be here talking to like the Lord High Priest and hopefully Rapthorn still can't get here for some reason. But let's see what happens. So, Raptor is still a dog, right? As far as we know. But it's been a long time since we, since we saw him fly out or Kusum or whatever. So who knows what's going on with Raptor. Uh... Okay, so we're, like, behind everything. So that's the Lord High Priest place. Let's actually look around back here, first of all. I highly doubt there'll be monsters back here. I mean, this is like Temp Templar HQ, right? Or is that Mar Mayella Abbey, where all the Templars are? It's kind of unclear. Uh, it's like this is just like a nice place to just come and visit. If NCS was here, he'd probably say this would be a nice place to sleep. Eh, well, he might, I don't know. I don't know, I'd sleep here. <laughs> okay, seriously, though. I don't know. I don't see any chests, so I'm assuming we'll just have to go into the mansion. Okie dokie, Smokey. Can we? Oh, we can't just fall. Darn. Come on, hero. I mean, Yoshi. <laughs> hmm, excuse me. Okay. Ah. Uh, yeah, I don't really know what else to say. I mean, we haven't seen Raptor in forever, so you would think that he would have killed the Lord High Priest long ago, but I don't know. There might be like a magical barrier or something around here. Uh, cutscene? Maybe? I think so. Give it a second. Oh, hey there, Pally. Someone's coming. Actually, that's not a bad idea. Who, who knows what Marcello would do if he saw us here? You wanted to see me, Your Holiness? Hmm. This place is far removed from the secular world. Yeah. I understand. I will see that the Templars take charge of Your Holiness's security. Does Marcella not know about Raptor coming here? I honestly can't remember. But rumors know no bounds, Marcello. I what? hear your name what? among the whisperings. There are disturbing allegations oh. surrounding you. That was a premature um uh, reaction there, Marcello, but I like how it was <laughs> that was pretty impressive, actually. Maybe more than mere rumors. Wait, what kind of allegations were there? Oh, wait. No, what allegations were there? The talent should always be the victims and end of your holiness. Surely you don't believe these. Abbot Francisco was very dear to me. My one true friend. We were very close. 
Oh jeez. Yeah, that's a shame. I am employing you as master of my guard for a very good reason. For Francisco. Hmm. That explains a lot, actually. When you were abandoned by your parents, he raised you in the abbey as if you were his own son. Yeah. The least I can do for him is to keep a close eye on you. Whoa. Ouch. Don't stray any further from the fold. Hmm. Marcello, you are intelligent and competent. You have clearly demonstrated that in your command of the Templars. But can you not satisfy yourself with that? If you persist with your current duplicity, I will have no choice but to discipline you. Wait, what has Marcello been doing that's been uncouth or anything? He's just but been I climbing the so ranks, right? Just as to think it's only you. The church is riddled with corruption oh. and bribery. I suppose I am largely to blame for being too lenient. So, Marcello's been bribing his way to the top, boy? Now, let that be the end of this discussion. And by the way, Yoshi, you're not exactly hiding yourself very well. Underneath this overleaping ambition, you have a good son. There is still time for you to mend your ways. Well, I guess even the, a lot of churches in general just kind of go against ambition and try to tell you to be humble and be happy with what you, you got. Maybe that's just what the message you're trying to say right now. Maybe it's not that he was bribing people, but just that he's spending so much time trying to climb the ranks that he's not appreciating what he has? I don't know. Maybe I'm not getting the full story. Francisco, my old friend. I should have known the book of his conscience would be closed to me. Guide his strange soul. Lest he lose it. <laughs> I, s I don't know. I don't think Marcello's gonna end up a villain. No, if anything, it's like a rival or an anti-hero or something, but I don't think... <laughs> it's weird, like, went back when he was, like, wasn't really doing anything wrong, I... I, uh... I didn't really trust him, but now they're... Now the game itself is starting to put some suspicion on him, and I'm like... Eh, he'll probably be fine. <laughs> I don't know, I just... Oh, this is like... The, key, the heartless symbol from Kingdom Hearts. But anyway. I don't know. Hey, maybe there's some mini mills over here, guys. <laughs> I'm losing my way, too. I'm thinking about that miracle sword at Princess Minnie's place as opposed to actually saving these sages. Uh, maybe the church can save me. Who knows? Ooh, the sage's robe. That might be for Jessica. But then she won't be as sexy. <laughs> okay, nah. Don't let lust. Don't let the lust blind your eyes, Yoshi. No, well, it's not even for Jessica. It's for uh, Angelo. Reduces damage from spell by 25 points. And this. Oh, okay. Perfect. Right? Yeah, that's cool. Wait a minute. That was right, right? Yeah. Okay. So it wasn't a big increase, but that helped. Okay. <clears throat> Excuse me. So... so this, well, this is greed right now. Is there no vice I will not stoop to? Oh. Mini metal. Thank you, Lord High Priest, sir. Hello, what do you have to say? I make food for everyone around here. Lord High Priest, the Templars, and even the little birds. Aw, that's kind of sweet. I was so busy that I probably forgot how to sit still by now. Hmm. Well, let's all get yourself sick. Hmm. Okay, so... Hello. Hi, little... High Priest Rollo. Rollo? Rollo. Rollo, Rollo sounds better. He's currently resting in this room. He can be rather... overbearing. 
Oh, is it? We may need to go in there next. Let's actually look around first. Actually, are the gods guards saying anything? Lord High Priest. Huh, how come they're not kicking us out? We kind of bypassed everything to get up here. What's in here? This looks... Oh, whoa. Nope, that looks like plot stuff. Excuse me, sorry. I thought you said that he was wrestling high... Well, maybe it's not... Maybe high priest and lord high priest something different. But if it's a named NPC, it's probably important. Mm, yeah, we still... Again, we still don't know if Rapthorn is still in the body of Leopold, or if he took a new host. Yeah, that's so weird to think about. Rapthorn's sort of like a parasite right now. Yeah, that's creepy. Oh, wait, what? Where'd you come from? And... What? What's with that grin, man? So that confounded Marcello thinks he's too good to pay his... He's too good to pay his bribe that he's the master of the guard? He's only got the position because of my personal recommendation. The ungrateful swine. When I become Lord High Priest, he'll soon see the error of his ways. Lord, you go Dude, I've been standing here... Well, I guess I really can't chastise you. I didn't even notice you at first. <laughs> Excuse me. So, Martello really was bribing people? And eh, that's a little disappointing. Okay. Whoa. Uh, check this room first. I know it's... I know, I know, I'm terrible. Uh, so nothing in here. Actually, don't want to waste time, but... Um, there's really nothing to these paintings. Mm, actually, I wonder if we could talk to Marcello before we talk to Lord High Priest first. Eh, we can do that later. Uh, don't sneeze. Oh, the mini metal. Okay, good. Oh no, I'm gonna sneeze. Sorry. <laughs> Sorry, excuse me. Woo! Okay, I thought the cold was gone, but I guess not. <laughs> okay, um, excuse me, hopefully I'm not disturbing you, sir. Ah, the goddess moves in mysterious ways. How do you know there's something special about this? Ha ha ha, sorry, did I surprise you? Take no notice, it's just the nonsensical musings of an old man. May the goddess be with you on your travels. Oh, well... Uh, thank you, sir? Our father? Or Lord High Father? I don't know. Um, yes, sir? <laughs> that was nice. So maybe you need, actually do need to speak with Marcello. What am I doing? I should be talking to my party members, see what they have to say about all this. Angelo... Well, we'll save Angelo for last, last. I reckon you should live in a big, posh mansion like this one. You should live in... Oh, God. I got high hopes. Well, that was mighty nice of you, Yangus. Thank you. I can't believe I'm actually saying this. Oh, sorry. I can't believe I'm actually saying this, but I owe my mother some thanks for all those years of drilling proper manners into me. Speaking of which, what does happen to people who don't behave properly in front of the Lord High Priest? That's... <laughs> uh, I hope not. Squash... <laughs> I've got his giant thumb. <laughs> this place is enormous. There are plenty of Templars on duty, mind, and they all look fairly fearsome, too. Good old Captain Marcello, eh? He may have had social skills with a dark tile, but he certainly knows how to do his job. Well, yeah, that's one thing to say, Mar Mar Marcello. Well, I guess the Lord High Priest said so himself. It's Marcello's good at his job. It's just that he should cool his heels a little bit. I really should start referring to all these guys as NPCs, because technically, pretty much everyone except for the four main characters are NPCs. Like, even King Trode would be, and Medea are considered NPCs, but... Okay, seriously, where are we supposed to go? New recruits? Oh, do you think we're recruits for the Templars? Interesting. But that's why they haven't kicked us out. Um... Do they say the same thing, or what? 
Yeah, okay. So, where the devil are we I, yeah, I'm pretty sure we need to f talk to Marcello then next, right? I mean, I know this is where we're supposed to be, right? I mean... Raptor was on his way here, for Pete's sake. You would think there would be a story of that. Well, I guess there was one. But... I'm so surprised he haven't run into... Marcello was walking this way when the cutscene ended, but... Ah, darn. Eh, okay, I'll cut right here, guys, and I'll let you know when I find where we're supposed to be going. Okay, guys, so this is where we are right now, and if we zoom in, it looks like there's a town over here, which I'm pretty sure I didn't go to, so I'm gonna check that out and maybe check this area out over here too and then I'll let you know if I find anything cool so see you in a sec oh hello Jessica levels up to 37 HP 15 6 nice 2 4 9 1 okay uh, I guess 5 here and 4 in sex appeal that seems fine. Wonder Whipper. Cool. Nice. So she got another five um, attack. Nice. Ooh, a sultry lady. Pink Typhoon? What the heck? But they need to show that off, apparently. Well, here we go, guys. Here's Pink Typhoon. Sun Typhoon that rips a group of enemies into ribbons? Let's just see what we got here. That's kind of cool, like this, huh? Oh, cool! Yangus leveled up to 38. HP by 10, MP by 5, 2, 2, 5, 2. Six skill points. Oh, he's starting to taper off again. That's weird. Three in axes and three humanity, I guess. And great axeman improves his hatchet man technique and masters executioner. Weird. Let's check that out real quick, actually. Uh, executioner. Powerful roundhouse strike that fells an opponent in one blow if it hits. Oh, so... Yeah, everyone told me to use that on the Metal King Slime, so maybe I'll try doing that next time. Uh, well, I guess a new enemy is Cyclops. So, let's just try him out. Yeah, <laughs> what the heck, let's try Executioner. Um, you can try it out, and... Well, let's just now well, let's just do a frizzle. Let's see how this turns out. And did it paralyze? No, it didn't. Darn. Uh, come on, come on. 156, not bad. So his magic defense isn't all that good. Don't know how his regular defense is. Looks like it's, he's about average. His attack's pretty high, though. Relatively speaking. Oh, jeez! Good job, Yangus. Okay, well, I guess that was a Cyclops, then. Well, hello, mini-boss enemy. What the devil are you? Arch? Arch demon, huh? Actually, no. Psych up. Psych up. Rune staff. And psych up. Hmm, I have no idea what to make out of this guy. He's in a flying area, so, uh, he should be fairly tough. I wonder if he's recruitable. I don't know, it just seems weird. It's like he's walking along the bridge like he's guarding it. That's a pretty good attack, too. Psych up, psych up. Just in case... Nah. You can... Try paralyzing him and just get sick up too. Well, does that do anything? Nope. Now it seems to have a really low percentage of working. Uh, oh well. Well, now he's gonna have to use a full heal this turn. Psych up. And everyone's at 20, except for Angelo. Okay. So, now let's just go all out. Falcon Slash. 
Nah, we can we don't need to use executioner again. Angelo, you need to use a full heal. And now let's well, yeah, we can do twin dragon lash, why not? Hopefully he doesn't have really strong defense or something like that. Nope, he seems about normal. Hmm. Have we even seen this enemy type before? He doesn't look very familiar. Hmm, but he does have a lot of HP, that's for sure. Uh, how much more can he really have? Let's just keep attacking him. Let's, well, let's, let's try a good frizzle this time. See if this magic defense is any worse or any better than his regular defense, and is about average, I guess. That's all I can really say about him. But he does have a lot of HP. 31. Ooh, a gold monster coin. Nice. Um. Yeah, we will. Who do you want to get rid of? Dead Noble? Yes. Yeah, he's. I think this guy is quite a bit better. Except for agility, but looks like he can take a hit pretty well anyway, so it's fine. Actually, no, his defense is actually lower. But we're not gonna be using Dead Noble again, I don't think. Yeah. Okay, cool. Archfiend. Okay. Actually, what's around here? Nothing. Well, we know this is a flying-only area, so I guess we just keep exploring. Well, hello, new enemy. Another Cyclops, huh? Big blue bully. Okay, uh... Psych up? Psych up? Actually, man, nah, let's just let's call our team. See where this takes us. Speaking of which, this is all uh, in that little island-ish area I found earlier. So... See how this goes. Yeah, it's probably just about acting the same as the other uh, Cyclops enemies. There's probably more HP and you know, slightly more attack and stuff. But he's sure taking the hits. And, man, that uh, statue. <laughs> That team member, he is. He is something else. He's been taking the hits and he's conditioning it out. Uh, I do make that a little bit, but he's. But yeah, this stone bully. I'm mean, not stone bully. Uh, stone statue. He's he's been putting his work in. That's for sure. And the big blue, big blue bully's defeated. Jeez. 346. Angelo levels up too. Jeez. Uh, HP by 16, MP by 3, 3, 2, 6, 1. Uh, some more in staves and some more in charisma. Because I don't know what else, what else to give him. Becomes a wizard. Ooh, Cadassius. Oh, I think that's like a heal that uh, doesn't cost any MP, which is pretty nice. Crystal Knight. Ooh, Cafuddle. That's. Nah, eh, I probably never use it. Silver Monster Coin. I need to sell these Monster Coins at some point. Um, no. Yeah, I don't. No, we have plenty of good monsters. I don't see why we'd ever need Big Blue, Big Blue Bully. Unless he has a really incredible move, but I think I'm really liking my team as it is. He unlocked the chest, and what do we get? Ooh, another mini metal. Awesome, sus. Oh, that was kind of lame. Okay, uh, see you guys in a little bit. Well, here's the treasure chest. Where, see, that's the bridge where you fought, um,. Uh, that one guy, can't remember what his name was, the demon, the arch, arch, arch demon or something? Okay, open the chest and we get a piece of super spicy cheese. I couldn't even see what the icon for it looked like. Okay, uh, keep still exploring this one area. Oh, hello. Actually, it seems like... What's going on here? Trangoli? Huh. Well guys, in the next part of Dragon Quest VIII, I think we're going to explore this town, which has a monster in it for some reason. Okay guys, thank you so very much for watching, and have a great day. Peace out.